Hi guys welcome to Indian football supporters channel. If you are new to watch video of this channel subscribe this channel to know more about Indian football. It is going to be useful for you. Last time I asked question in last video. How many teams played I league 2020 to 21 season? An answer is commented by Jayanth. I will pin a question in comment box who answers first they will get mentioned in. My next video. Ok guys let's go to the video. We have a good news about Chennain FC. According to some reports their midfield magician Rafael Crivellero was set to extend his contract on Chennain FC. This was a good news for Chennain FC fans. He missed last season because of injury. He was an amazing player he was the core part of Chennain FC. He is their captain in last season but he missed. Season by an injury. He would be eager to play next ISL season. Let's wait for a confirmation from CFC. Ok guys we have another news about CFC. Some news coming they are going to release their two center back Eli Sabia and NS Sipovich. This combination not worked well in last season. Let's hope they will sign good center backs. Ok guys we have good news for Indian football fans I asked to. Star Sports India do you broadcast India's world qualifiers? And they said yes. It was a good news for Indian football fans. We can see matches in Star Sports. Ok guys we have rumor about FC Goa an amazing Spanish striker was linked with FC Goa. He scored 120 goals in 144 matches for Red Bull Salzburg. He scored that 120 goals in Austrian top tier. According to some reports Igor Angulo was leaving. FC Goa so they can sign this striker. His name is Jonathan Soriano. Played in La Liga for Espanyol. He was played for Saudi Arabian side Al Hilal and Chinese Super League. He have experience in Asia. There is small chances to sign him. His market value was near 2 crore and he is free agent. Let's hope they will sign good replacement for Igor Angulo. Ok guys we got a news about rising Indian star. Apuya there is news came he was leaving Northeast United FC. But some local newspapers reported he was going to extend his contract in Northeast United FC. It was a good news for Northeast United fans. Some Indian clubs like Mumbai City FC was interested in him. Some news says Mumbai City FC talked with Northeast United FC about Apuya. Northeast asked big transfer fees. But Northeast again said. We don't giving Apuya it was reported by some Instagram pages. Ok guys video is over I hope you liked this video. Wear mask when you go out. Pray for country. Obey rule of government. Keep support.